Growing up several classes behind my sister, as a child I was known as Karen's brother. And, excuse me, but Rivka to me is Karen. Later, Rivka's brother. And I can think of no greater honor. I've never known anyone who has dosed so deeply affected so many lives. This was true long before we learned of the cancer, and she never stopped or even slowed down. Only a righteous person could take such a difficult challenge and use it to further help and inspire others. Karen did more in her too few years than most of us could even dream of in a lifetime. And from the beginning to the end, she never lost that glint in her eyes. She never lost her sense of humor. I have found all of Karen's friends who I've met and come to know over the years to be wonderful, inspiring people in your own rights. Even in Jerusalem, finding so many incredible people takes God blessings and takes such an incredible person. Of all the amazing people, I can think of none more impressive than her children. Yafa, Menachem, Lisa. Your Dara Haritz inspires me. Yuri Menaba done so well so far. True B'nai Mitzvah. Karen's work here is done but not finished. It's now left us all to try to affect those around us as she did. Our lives, may we merit to face our lives with her courage, and may we all know Simcha and Nasara. I, I have no doubt that right now she is busy making a balagan <laughs> to shake up the heavens, no doubt, on behalf of her children, her family, her friends, and Paul Yisrael. 